Hey everyone, I'm Dahlia and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be reviewing my most recent box box and the one I received this month because I, I receive them pretty often, not once a month, but this month anyway, because you have to do it within a month. So um, this is the Rouge L'Oreal Rouge Signature Vox Box and there are three lip colors in there. I received 416 I Create, 414 I Rule, and 426 I am worth it so these are the three colors as you can see I just want to like share with you a couple of things it says on the box because like it has to do with like the formula it says less is more um, less texture more color bare lip sensation lasting matte impact uh, yeah that's about it so with this formula I was really excited to try these because these are very affordable I think they're like ten dollars and um, I okay what do I say <laughs> so I'm a little spoiled when it comes to like product like, I haven't really bought like a drugstore lipstick in a long time and then I was excited about it too because you know I've always had lips like tried liquid lipsticks and I remember when the first one came out I think it was lime crime that came out with a formula like that and then afterwards like all of these uh, places started making liquid lips but never have I tried like a drugstore one so this is supposed to be a lighter formula it's uh, not it's supposed to feel bare on the lips that's what the box says I read up on it so it's supposed to be a lighter formula um, however I just don't know how I feel about it I don't know if, if I'm spoiled if you really enjoy these I'm sorry but there was just something about these that I did not like this I think this is the first Vox box where I was like mm, okay the first one I tried obviously was the red one because I was excited then I tried this one uh, I was I'm not really like this is too nude for me but it's still you know a nice color and then this is the one that I have on now I don't know if you see it it, it is very light it doesn't feel like anything but there's this oh okay first of all before I start complaining let me praise what's going on here so it is very light it doesn't feel like anything it's matte it feels good like you don't feel like you're wearing a whole bunch there's not gonna be any cracking no cracking so those are the like pluses when it comes to this I'm sorry if I'm like all over the place it's just like don't know how I feel about it I know how I feel about certain things and then I know how I feel about like how I feel about other things but whatever so the applicator is amazing this is like a super precision applicator and I love it I think everything should have an applicator like this because it's so easy to apply now yeah see Yeah, it's the smell. I can't. It's like a floral. It's almost perfumey. And for that to be on your lips, like, I can kind of taste it a little bit. So it's like, it's not really nice to like lick it. Some lipsticks, you'll lick it and it's fine. It don't taste like anything. But this has a little bit of a, a floral taste and I don't like it. I don't know what it is. Oh, I wanted to like these. I really did because they're only $10 and I was like, oh, I'm going to go and buy a whole bunch of them. But I don't know if that's going to happen because when I go to use, like when I'm like, oh, let me use something. This is not what I want to reach for. And I've reached for them because I've been trying them out and I want to give you a really good review. Like I want to make sure that I'm honest and that I've tried it. So as for how long it lasts, it lasts a few hours. I did eat with it. It did fade after a few hours. It's not like the super long lasting formula. Um, it's been on my lips for a little bit. A little bit. It did transfer a little bit. And then we try to move that with the lighter colors. It doesn't happen so much, but with the red, you will have staining when there's transfer so for kissing it's not the best the nudes not so bad nobody's gonna notice I don't think like it the nudes come off but you'll see what I'm talking about with the red because I am gonna put these on for you and swatch them and everything so I really like this color this color is called I rule and it's the one I have on now it's a beautiful like pinky nude and it really does feel like nothing so like that's what I'm saying it has like I like that I like that it feels like nothing I like that there's not gonna be any cracking but it's matte you know it's good I like that I can like move it around a little bit and it doesn't feel bad but I taste yeah 
So that's this is this color right here. I'm going to show you the other two colors. I think this is good for people who don't like the fact that liquid lips are thick and sometimes drying. There are some good formulas out there, but they are very drying. And this doesn't do that. Like, I don't feel like my lips are dry. They're only dry because I'm rubbing it with a stupid little tissue. The one I was wearing was I Rule, right? Yeah. So obviously the red is going to stain, which I like, but then sometimes I don't like. This is I Create. See that applicator? It's so cute. I like it. And then so easy to apply. Look at that. I feel like this color disappears on me. I don't know. I'm just not a nude person, but it is very, very pretty. It's just I'm not a nude lip person. I have nothing to complain about when it comes to the colors. They're gorgeous. And then like you could let it dry down and it won't move as much. But there is like I showed you when I did like the little kiss on my hand and I pressed pretty hard. There's a little bit of transfer when it comes to these. Well, not a little bit. There's some there's transfer. So that is I create. Do the kissy face. You can see it. See, and now it's starting to dry. I think it goes really nice with the makeup that I have on now. So, so next color, which is the red. And it's very light, very airy. I love that about the formula. I just wish it didn't smell like that. Like, I wish it smelled like vanilla or something. Something yummy, you know? Because I don't like floral on my mouth. It feels like when I accidentally spray perfume in my mouth. Blech. I think that's one of the main reasons why I don't reach for these. The smell. And that it's not like that nourishing. It sits on your lips, it's light, it's not drying, but it's not nourishing either. And I'm all about nourishing. I'm just a lipstick person, but... When you don't know how to feel. Next lipstick. So, or lip... Liquid lip, whatever. Lip ink. These are called lip inks, by the way. Signature Rouge lip inks. Okay, welcome to my video about Signature Rouge, Signature Rouge lip inks. The ink makes sense because you'll see with this one, it's kind of a stain. So I, f I don't know if it's with, with the other darker colors, if that happens. But if it does, it's kind of a nice thing. And then, but when there's transfer, it's not so nice. So I'll, sh I'll show you. It went in my mouth and it don't it doesn't taste good Ugh. I think I messed up on one side but whatever <laughs> it is all over the place this is what I'm talking about this is what I don't like the formula while not being thick and drying is also a little bit watery and gets all over the place so it is a beautiful color I enjoy the color I think it's gorgeous I love the way that it applies, the way that the applicator applies the product. The watery formula, sometimes it moves around if you put a little bit too much. So if you want to use these, I advise not using too much at a time because that could end up happening. Once it dries down, it's very matte. As you can see, it's not shiny anymore, even though it came out of the tube shiny. Um, yeah, I like, I think it's a very pretty color, so. Okay, so yeah, so final thoughts now that you've seen all the colors. You saw I Rule in the beginning, that's what I was wearing, and then you saw I Create, and now here is I Am Worth It. And the reason why I'm not gonna put this one back on is because I will show you as soon as like we're almost done. You'll see the lips are stained. That's a good thing because you don't want it to fade too fast and you wanna make look like you know you still have it on, but it's, it's a bad thing when you accidentally get it on your hand and it won't come off. Like, it will not come off. My fingers kind of stained. Like, I got it on there when I wiped it off. And that's like a normal thing I'll do. I'll just wipe on my finger and try to wipe it off, but it's stained. <laughs> so, But the pigmentation is very beautiful. It didn't take a lot of product to get to this. I did accidentally use a little bit more than I should have and it got watery. It dries down very nice. Look, and then when I do this... <laughs> No cracking. So if you don't like liquid lipsticks because of cracking, and when you do things like that, like when you extend your lips and then it's like, well, cracked, you could get this one because it doesn't do that. However, there's a taste, that taste. I lick my lips and stuff, so eventually it goes away, but it's so annoying. 
This is why I don't reach for them as much as I would if it didn't have that. So that is my review. Ooh, you saw that nice, I caught it. I hope it was helpful. Um, I have really mixed feelings about this product. I, I like it and I don't like it. I don't know what to say. It's just mixed feelings. It, at first I gave it like a four because I was like, oh, it doesn't crack and blah, blah, blah. But then when like the taste kept going and I realized that I wasn't reaching for it, I kind of took away a star because I was like, it's not that great to me. I'm so mixed. I'm so, I'm right in the middle. I just don't know how to feel. I hope this helps you. If it doesn't, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't know. Now, really quick, I'm gonna take this off and I'm gonna show you the staining, so. See that? See, so that's stained. It was still coming off. Get another tissue, but whatever. Ow. Okay, that's it. My lips are stained. They are staying this color for another few hours. So yeah that's what i mean like good thing because now look i look like i have natural freaking berry colored lips hey i look good i look young because my lips are so plump and fresh and rosy but then again like what if i want to change color the darker colors do stain you might like that sometimes i do like that so who knows still mixed feelings anyway <laughs> yeah I'm just in the middle. I don't know how to feel. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.